This is my uh, <clears throat> scale model Lister D engine. Uh, it has a uh, three-quarter inch bore, three-quarter inch stroke. It's powered by compressed air. It is four-stroke in operation. It has a camshaft that operates at one-half the speed of the crank, so it gets a power stroke every uh, other revolution, just like a uh, full-size four-stroke engine. <clears throat> Although it's somewhat stylized, it's pretty close, I think, in uh, appearance and uh, scale dimensions to a full-size Lister. As you can see here, it's, this is a six inch ruler. <clears throat> it's about a little less than six inches tall, probably five and a half inches tall. It has a three inch flywheel made out of brass. <clears throat> the main part of the engine is mostly made out of aluminum. Um, <clears throat> uh, and the internals are mostly aluminum as well, except for the, uh, the piston, which is cast iron, and the uh, crankshaft, which is uh, leaded steel. So let me fire it up here and uh, see how it works. That's uh, wide open, running on about 120 PSI of air. Uh, it uses a special uh, valve that has a uh, cam-driven intake valve. Uh, which allows, admits, it's a poppet valve, allows, admits air into the piston. And then it has a spring-loaded slave valve, which is pushed aside by the incoming uh, air to, uh, to uh, let the air into the cylinder. And then when the intake valve closes, the spring returns the valve to uh, a, an exhaust open position. So the exhaust is open for the rest of the, of the strokes. Slow it down a little bit here. See, it'll slow down and idle pretty well. got the timing kind of slow on it so it'll run real slow. If I advanced the timing I could probably make it run faster, but that wouldn't really be characteristic of a Lister uh, industrial style engine. 